I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. <laughs> like, oh, Miss Jen is talking. Friends are not. <laughs> Capiche? Capa. Hey, beautiful people. How y'all doing today? It's your girl, Maria Davis, and I am back again with another interesting video. So I saw this video on TikTok and it got so interesting to me and I was just laughing. Women came together and they were like, let's speak to this man the way we speak to a preschool student a preschool person is somebody that is just starting school a baby a child i'll call them a baby they're also like a small baby a small child you know because sometimes these men don't listen and truly they want us to be their mother okay now let us speak to them <laughs> like they are preschool students so few people stitch this video you know trying to give us example how it to look like talking to a man in a preschool student uh you know how, you, how you're gonna talk to a preschool child they're not saying it like they're talking to a man it's just it's, it's quite interesting so i decided to bring you for you all to watch so let's watch the she's together i think i'm gonna start talking to men the way i talk to my preschool students <laughs> oh no don't touch don't touch please no I said to look and we look with our eyes, not our hands, right? We keep our hands to ourselves. Yep, we just look. No touch, please. Thank you. Thank you for listening, right? We listen with our ears. Thank you. I, I don't know what you're gonna say to me if you're gonna yell and you're gonna scream, right? Right, we gotta use our big boy words, yep. Yep, do you maybe wanna think about it for a second before we say something that might be a little hurtful? yeah i think i'm gonna start talking to men the way i talk to my preschool students <laughs> oh talking to grown adults in this case men like they're still in preschool i'm sure that that will go over very well in fact i'm sure that this miss jen is talking friends are not <laughs> capiche Kapa. would be about the nicest possible response that a person could honestly hope to get if they actually think that talking to grown adults like they're still in preschool is even remotely a good idea. Something about treat others as one would like to be treated. But it's actually an excellent example as to one of the many reasons why so many men have actually just decided to give up on dating and relationships altogether. I mean, what would be worth it about it? Why would they even want to engage with individuals who do not treat them like adults or see them as equals? I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. Uh-oh, no, that's not happening. No, we do not put things up our noses, friends. It can make our bodies very sick. No more putting things in your nose. You should know better. It's not good for you. I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. Nice words or no words at all. Oh, all done. All done. Let's go charge our listening ears. Are we having big feelings? One, two, three. All eyes on me. You can either be nice to me or be single. Make good choices. Make good choices. Whoa, those are big emotions, bud. Do you understand me? Should I repeat myself? Oh, I like how my friend over here is deciding to use his words, right? <laughs> Uh-oh. Let's turn our listening ears on. Look at me while I'm talking to you so I know you're listening. I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. No, thank you, friend. No, thank you. You can either be nice to me or be single. Make a good choice. Make a good choice. I am not happy with you right now. I am very unhappy with you right now. No, let's take a break. Let's take a break. Use your words. I don't understand head nods. Do you understand? Yes or no? Uh, yes or no? If you can hear me, touch your toes. I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. <laughs> oh, I see we're struggling with our listening ears. Do we need to turn them back on? Let's turn on our listening ears. Turn them on. Listen, listen, listen. Thank you, friends. Great job. I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. William, was that your idea? Yes or no? Uh, yes or no? Because that's what Tiffany just said 10 minutes ago. Shh, Steven. 
Miss Jen is talking, you are not. Let's put our listening ears on, yeah? Jonathan, we all know what that means. I went to engineering school too, yes. Yes, you're getting it. Good job. I'm going to give you a sticker. Ooh, that was inappropriate. Not good, Timothy. Can you apologize? Otherwise, we'd have to go to the HR office and we don't like going there, do we? Mm -mm, we don't. I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. <laughs> Boys, I'm going to out us here on this one. Sweetheart, I promise you it would work. I promise you. Not based off personal experiences or anything. Um, we're toddlers with bank accounts. If you talk to us like your preschoolers, a little less condescending. It was funny, but a little less condescending. It would work. Tell us what you would like to do or what you would like us to do but in like, uh, it was our idea kind of thing. Sorry, dudes. And, and, it'll, and it'll work. We're toddlers with bank accounts. We are. We're just grown toddlers with bank accounts. We can do more stupid shit because we have more money to do it. But if you do it, I promise you, it'll work. I think I'm going to start talking to men the way I talk to my preschool students. Oh, are we being a good listener right now? Mm -mm. Can we listen with our mouth? No, what do we listen with? Our ears, exact good job. Okay, but I don't just want you to tell me that you're sorry. I want you to show me. Can we have a better day tomorrow? Okay, thank you. Do you think you're making Miss Howard happy right now? No. Uh-uh, no. We are inside. We are going to use our inside voice, please. Oh, we are not using those kind of words in here. Nice words out of your mouth only. Thank you. We're going to keep our hands to our selves. Good job. Good job. And worry about who? About yourself. Absolutely. Worry about yourself. Thank you. If you're still here, definitely you're enjoying this video. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe and all of that good stuff. Okay? <laughs> I know some men are not going to like this. Most men are not going to like this video. <laughs> They want us, they want us, they want a mom or they want a woman to be their mom, but they don't want us to treat them like a child. I don't know how to explain it. They want a woman, they want a partner to do everything that their mom does cook, clean, take care of you, do that, do that, do that, do that, provide for you as well. But they don't want a woman to talk down on them like they're a child. I don't know if you understand what I'm trying to say. They don't want they want that ego. They want that respect. But then you want a woman that would you want a woman that does exactly what your mom does. <laughs> you want a mom in your relationship as your woman. But you don't want the woman to treat you like a child. I know most men will not like this when they see this type of shit. You comment on these videos. They're hilarious from men. They were hilarious. <laughs> Anyways, that's just the video I brought. Something different for you all to watch today. Let me know your thoughts about this video down in the comment section. Thank you all so much for sticking around to this point. I hope you enjoyed this one. Don't forget to like and share and subscribe. I don't know that good stuff. And I'll see you all in my next video. Bye.